Hey guys, how's it going? Marcelo here. Today I wanted to do a discussion video, and this is kind of like an out of the blue kind of thing, but I think I'll be doing discussion videos periodically. There's no real set schedule yet. I do have a couple of subjects I do want to go over, and today, if you read the title, and I hope you did, <laughs> uh, this is something that I've thought about and even talked about on Trash Talk on Westside Studios quite a lot now, uh, quite recently at this point in time, and Nintendo just you can tell they really want to do it. Super Mario Galaxy 3, that is something that should really happen. And I want to say why. This is, these are my thoughts of why Mario Galaxy 3 should happen. So, it was unearthed recently, <laughs> this news from Nintendo that uh, Shigeru Miyamoto has said, we want to do it. We're ready to do another big 3D action game, and I think those were his words. But, they, they're not ready to do another galaxy. Like, they say they want to, and I hope to God they do at some point soon. Uh, the original um, claims were that they were coming close and they were thinking about it. It was almost going to become a reality um, at some point, like pretty uh, recently, actually. Then I heard some news at the time of this recording that um, it turns out it's not really like a, it's not going to be another big Mario. Um, free roaming platformer like Galaxy, like the Galaxy games. It's going to be something more, um, faux linear, I don't know what you would call it. I heard quasi linear at some point. <laughs> Terms for linear. Uh, a game like Mario 3D Land or 3D World, let's say that. <laughs> um, will it be a sequel? Will the 3D World Land games become a trilogy? I don't know. Honestly, I don't think those games, like, because it's 3D Land, 3D World, 3D Universe, I don't know. I don't think that should be the trilogy. They need to do another 3D, or, or, or sorry, another Mario Galaxy game. Um, the reasons being is that ever since Mario 3D World, and you got Mario Kart 8 and Super Smash Bros. for Wii U and 3DS, they've been dropping Galaxy bombs and references all over the place, with Rosalina becoming a more... Um, I wouldn't say centered character, but she's been involved a lot more recently. Uh, she's in all three of those games, and she's just had a lot more focus than she did when she was introduced in Galaxy. Um, even in Galaxy 2, she has like a watered-down cameo appearance. But I think that with the fact that 3D World's last levels and last worlds are really heavily Galaxy-based, and the fact that there is a Mario Galaxy stage in Smash Bros. They want to do it. You can tell they really want to do it. And I say, I'm here to say go for it, Nintendo. No one is saying no. Um, there's been news that Pikmin 4 is happening. Uh, I just felt the need to throw that in. Because <laughs> uh, this Galaxy 3 info came out at around the same time, if not the exact same time. And you can tell that, so they're going back to, they're either trying to, you know, they're dipping their toe back in the water, in the galaxy waters, but then with Pikmin, it's like, well, we're just going to continue that series because people liked it and people want more. Uh, I'm not sure how, I know that Pikmin 3 did really good. I'm not a huge Pikmin fan myself. I've played, like, a little bit, I think, of the first one. Never played the second one, haven't played the third one. But with this announcement of the fourth one, it, it's, it's Nintendo saying yes to those who want it. I think that's kind of what I'm getting at. I'm not really sure how, I know that, like I said before, I know that Pikmin 3 did really good. I'm not sure how many people actually were out there were like, like fans out there were like, let's see another Pikmin, like another one after three. I don't know if that really, <clears throat> excuse me, happened, but, <clears throat> excuse me, um, Nintendo was like, four. Here it is, we're doing it, here you go. But nothing on Galaxy 3. This is the closest news to Nintendo saying we're going to do it that they ever got. And now they're retracting it saying, eh, it's not going to be another full-blown 3D free-roaming title. It's going to be something along the lines of 3D World. Um, so, that's like the background of like why they should do it. Here are the exact points, in my opinion, of why they should do it. Uh, number one, again, like I said before, they've been dropping all these galaxy references everywhere. 
in these past few Mario games. I'm not going to be surprised if there's some kind of weird secret thing in Super Mario Maker. At this point in time, in this time of the recording, I don't have that game. But by the time you're seeing it, I probably most likely already do. Um, so I'll even probably do a video on that telling you my thoughts on Super Mario Maker. Anyway, back to Galaxy. Um, so there's been so many bombs and references dropped in accordance to Galaxy. The other thing that I'd like to say is imagine Galaxy on the Wii U and not a, a, an HD re-release of Galaxy 1 and 2. Because I've been hearing that a lot. Even one of my friends on Facebook, my personal Facebook, always tells me when I, whenever I mention a Galaxy 3 or just Galaxy in general, he's like, they should do a re-release. And I'm like, I don't think so. Galaxy 1 and 2 were good on the Wii. They're like one of the most beautiful looking games on the Wii. So with that, imagine that with the graphics and all that of 3D World, but another full-blown installment of Galaxy. Like, that would be amazing. And I actually thought that's what they were going to lead with um, when the Wii U first came out in 2012, you know, like an, er like an early to mid-2013 game. That would have been amazing. Um, and then my suspicions rose again during E3 of 2015 when I was like, I've said it before, on Trash Talk, you, I, there's, I'm on record going, I wish and I hoped that they would announce Galaxy 3, but they didn't. Um, with this info that came out though, I think that with the Mario series in general, so this is like a whole other discussion within itself that I'll be dabbling into in this video and might do in another video, or even video series at some point, but um, the Mario series needs to be revamped. Like that much, I believe, should happen. Because um, these games have been doing good, but don't get me wrong. 3D World is actually one of the better 3D Mario games to come out since Galaxy 2, so... They've been developing like a formula that works now. I mean, not just the whole tired plot of creatures capture go save it. Which, I know that there are reasons for that as well, but I'm not saying they should bring the big-ass plots of the RPG games or something into, you know, standard platforming mainstay Mario games, but they should do something different. They should do something more, in my opinion, and according, you know, according to Mario. Um, but, on the Wii U, because the Wii U didn't have, um, it didn't do so great when it first started. They had some awesome games like, uh, Rayman Legends. But then again, that didn't even come out until late 2013. And they didn't really hit their stride until 3D World. And they really didn't hit their stride until, um, or their stride really took off, you know, until, um, when, um, Smash Bros. came out in Mario Kart 8. And then it really took off when Splatoon came out. And it's going to get another big burst of Wii U everywhere once, you know, when Super Mario uh, Maker's out. And but then with all these amiibos and everything. So, like, just now, they're having to use these other, like, gimmicks, it seems, in terms of, like, amiibos or whatever, to, like, really get people's, you know, gears fired and all that. Um, get their gears going. But I think because everyone wants a Mario Galaxy 3. I think that that's something they should do as a swan song for the Wii U, like the Wii U's magnum opus, the Wii U's final big Nintendo first party title. That's what I think should happen. Um, I think I got lost in a couple of themes there. The, the Mario series has like this bit of a formula where it's just, you know, it's a lot of the same stuff. Like you've got the new Super Mario series, because the first Mario game to come out, it was like, I think one of the first exclusives, the first launch titles was you Super Mario Brothers U. Um, and while it was like, okay, I still was like, eh, <laughs> you know, that's a whole other discussion within itself. I'll probably do that at some point soon about specific Mario games and their formulas. Like, I'll probably do something about that in a video at some point. But there were a couple things I was going to say and I forgot what they were. Okay, so I think what I was trying to say earlier is there is a formula to certain Mario games. Um, Galaxy 3 would technically be following the Galaxy formula, but you could do like a lot more with it, especially with the gamepad and that kind of interaction. So, I don't know, there's a lot of room for like ideas and innovation that would make this like Galaxy trilogy just like awesome. First game came out, was really good. The second game, sequel, first 3D title to get as a direct sequel, really good. Third one brought a lot more to the table 
had the gamepad to not just use as a gimmick, but you know, as ways to uh, for certain means of travel or you know, obstacle to get arounds. It would be amazing. So I don't know if there's any loose ends I need to tie up real quick. There might be some stuff I brought up and then just kind of like stop talking about. Basically, before I ramble on way too long, I don't even know how long this video already is, probably like 8 to 10 or 11 or 12 minutes, I don't know. Um, basically, final thoughts. Nintendo, please make Super Mario Galaxy 3. They came so close to announcing it, I think they just need to announce it, or at least say it's going to be in the works. Um, be as vague as you want, <laughs> whatever, as long as like it were to happen. It would, and if it happened by the time the Wii U starts to like end its cycle, um, or even if it was a launch title for the NX, but really I think it should be like on the Wii U and be one of its final big games, to, first party Nintendo games to be released, that would be, that would be awesome. That would um, probably pull in a bunch more sales before the consoles finally, you know, eventually retire, and I think it would just benefit. Nintendo and their fans, because I for one would really like to see a new Mario Galaxy game on the Wii U, you know, full around, you know, all around high def, it would just be amazing. So I'm done rambling, I guess the question is, would you like to see this happen? Do you agree with me or disagree? Uh, let me know below, uh, if you want to see an HTV release of the first two, you can tell me that and I'll be like, it'd be cool, but, <laughs> you know, Galaxy 3. If it were a trilogy and they ended it off like that and the Wii U ended with this big game, I think that would be awesome. That's really it though. So I'm Marcelo and I'll see you guys later. Take care.